Okay, so this is a review of the Marriott Hotel in Milan on via Georgia, Washington, I think it's called. I will double check. Um, the hotel is undergoing a refurbishment at the moment. So I believe this is a, an original room, sorry, because half of the corridor is blocked off. And quite frankly, it looks very dated. I guess they'll reuse the television. The hotel is approximately 20, 30 minutes away from Lenate Airport. It's essentially the west side of Milan and the airport is east side. On a regular taxi, that costs essentially 40 euros and you do need to wear a mask if you are sitting at the front of the taxi. And I was, I was traveling with colleagues. Uber is eye-wateringly expensive because they only have Uber Black in Milan. So if you were planning to use it, watch the prices. For comparison, it was 138 euros to get an Uber from the airport. So you probably don't want to do that. Uh, the room is dated. It smells musky in here. Um, I wouldn't expect that from a chain, but perhaps the rooms just haven't really been used. I have no idea. Apparently there's some nice places to eat outside of the hotel to the left. The restaurant is currently closed. And the bar is open and breakfast is operating, but that's pretty much it. So as you come into the room, you've got, I don't know what size bed that is. Uh, it's not a, I don't know, maybe it's a double. It looks small and it's strange that it's against the wall and there's all of this space. I'm not liking the room. Anyway, um, so yeah, there's no power. No, so nothing... And that's solid marble, so you're not going to move that. Right, okay, so there's no power by the bed. Um, as you come in, you've got some hanging space, uh, wardrobe. Uh, there's no iron, so if you needed that, I guess you're going to have to ask. Nor is there an ironing, uh, sorry, nor is there a safe, unless it's in another cupboard. Okay, so, so you've got that. So I'm on the fourth floor, 4035. So all of this is currently closed off for renovation. So if I guess in the future you end up with a room 403 upwards to 431, you know that you've got a refurb room. Um, this confused the heck out of me. I could not figure out, and I'm thinking that could be an alarm. I have no idea, but I'm guessing that's where the card goes. There's a small aircon control that I'm not sure really works. Sorry, this is such a negative review. Let's go on the positives. It's very clean. So you've got a B-Day toilet, some toiletries, um... <laughs> okay, so this is interesting. They've mixed up different brands. So this works is one brand that you often see. Um, okay, and a little soap. You've got a shaver. Especially love these. Hotel hair dryer, in case you forget. Uh, there's no light there, so it's dark. And I imagine when you've pulled that across, it's going to be even darker yes uh, the ceiling is dirty you can see that there's marks everywhere um, I'm just trying to be a bit fair because I guess they're renovating everything so it'll be interesting to see what the new rooms are like perhaps um, yeah I mean you can see it's old right okay uh, let's see if we can find a safe perhaps Some astronomically large television uh, ah, okay, so there is a safe here, and some things to tempt you. So snacks are five euros. Let's... We've got a complimentary bottle of, sorry, a complimentary carton of water. I'm sure the tap water here is absolutely fine to drink. And a selection of teas and instant coffee. Oh, there's a power socket. That's the only one I've seen. 
Um, staff were really friendly to check me in and they gave us a recommendation for a place to eat for dinner. So we're going to walk there. It's a seven minute walk, apparently. And yeah, I mean, that's the room. Right, so breakfast is downstairs. There's a main restaurant. It's Buongiorno. Um, as you come in from reception, you'll see it here. If you've got a coffee to go area. It's good, because you don't often see that. They can make you coffee there. Got some cold meats and cheeses. Some fresh fruits. some hot food tomatoes either onion rings or calamari potatoes eggs and porridge some more hot food so you've got more varieties so scrambled eggs bacon sausages <coughs> Rosties and chicken wings and waffles and pancakes. Ooh, waffles look nice. Um, and you've got salads and some salad. And finally, some yogurts. Yeah. So, we've got some cold drinks, juices. Cereals, sorry, not cereals, um, toppings, condiments, gluten-free milks, there's the cereal, some pastries and sweet things, and some bread. Okay, so this is an updated video of the Milan uh, Marriott Hotel. Would I stay here again? No. It's an old room, I've confirmed with my colleagues, we've all got the same style. The breakfast is subpar. Surprisingly, the coffee isn't great either. Um, <clears throat> the staff are very friendly here, but it's just dated. The room is going to be refurbished. They're refurbishing half of each floor at the same time. Um, I've been bitten whilst I've been here, which has never happened before in a hotel, and I've stayed in a lot. They're doing building work right outside the window. I know it can't be helped, but it's noisy. And in the morning they have glass collections, which is really noisy. So you can't have the window open, but the aircon doesn't work. So 